Hello and welcome. In this video, we'll take a detailed look at the settings of the SignalBot in the three commas interface. The SignalBot connects your trading strategy directly to the market. It automates entries and exits based on external alerts or trading view strategies, while still giving you full control over risk. You can build something simple with a bot settings and webhook or a complete PineScript strategy that runs fully automated. In this walkthrough, we'll go through every setting of the signal bot so you can launch it with confidence. You'll see how to choose your signal source, set up entry and exit rules, configure take profit and stop loss, manage leverage and capital limits, and connect trading view strategies. Before we dive deeper, here's a quick tip. In the top right corner, you'll see the guide button. It opens short video tips about signal bot features, which is a quick way to get familiar with the basics. And if you prefer a hands-on walkthrough, just click, take a tour, and we'll guide you step-by-step -step through the main features of the GridBot interface. To get started, click the Start New Bot button at the top of the three commas interface and select Signal Bot. Now let's go into the main settings. This is where you decide how your bot will receive signals, which pairs it will trade, and how much risk it will take. You can choose between two signal types, custom signal and trading view strategy. The first option is called custom signal. In this setup, the bot utilizes the settings defined within the signal bot. You can copy the webhook message from your bot and paste it into trading view or another platform. When the webhook alert is triggered, it initiates various actions. This allows you to transform any trading view indicator or configuration into an automated trading strategy with the bot executing trades in real time. The second option is trading view strategy. Here, everything is controlled directly from PineScript. Order sizes, take profits, stop losses, and the bot simply executes whatever trading view sends. In this case, most settings inside the bot are hidden because all the logic is managed on the trading view side. Once you've picked the signal type, you can adjust the rest of the main settings. Give your bot a name so you can easily find it later. Choose the exchange where it will run, spot or futures. Then set the trading direction, long, short, or reversal. If you're on a futures account, you'll also configure leverage, either cross or isolated, and the value you want to use. Next, select the trading pairs for your bot, one or multiple, and set the maximum investment which limits how much of your balance the bot can use. If you're running multiple pairs, you can also limit the maximum number of active trades at the same time. After that, we move to the signal alerts section. Here you'll find the webhook URL that links your bot to external alerts. Simply copy this URL into TradingView or any other platform that supports webhook messages, and your bot will automatically receive and execute trading signals in real time turning your external alerts into live trades on your exchange. If you're using custom signals, you can also fine tune how entry and exit orders are handled. Entry orders allow signals to open or add to a position using a percentage of balance or fixed size. You can also send order size and type directly via webhook message. You can choose between market orders for speed or limit orders for precision and lower fees. The bot provides a ready code template to copy and adapt. Advanced options include filters by a price deviation from past or average entries to avoid repeated signals at the same price, reset filters on new trades, and limit the number of entries per smart trade. Exit orders work the same way, letting you close or partially close positions with their own JSON template and price deviation filters for accuracy. Take profit can be managed without external signals. Choose market or limit orders, set one target or up to four, and enable trailing take profit for the last target to lock profits if price reverses. For stop loss, you can add a break even with multiple take profits and trailing options to protect your capital and lock in profits. When your bot is live, you can manage it in the signal bot menu, where all bots are listed as all, active, or stopped. Here you can check profits, number of signals, and the overall status. You can also review trades in the Smart Trades menu. The Active tab shows open positions, while History shows completed trades. 
At the top, you'll see key PNL stats. And if you need to troubleshoot, go to the signals menu. This is where you'll find logs of all signals sent to the bot, and you can quickly see if they were executed or rejected and why. Before you set alerts on the trading view side, it's important to double check a few crucial points. Ensure that the trading pair selected in the bot matches the pair shown on the trading view chart. If you are using a futures exchange account in the bot, make sure the corresponding futures pair is also selected on the trading view chart. Verify that the exchange used in the bot corresponds with the exchange selected in trading view. If you are testing the strategy on a demo account, Select the Binance Spot Exchange account on the TradingView side and the appropriate trading pair to ensure that the signals reach the bot. If these settings do not align, the signal will not reach the bot and the trade will not be executed. Additionally, if you use the TradingView strategy and set the order size as a percentage of equity in the TradingView properties, the start date becomes important. This way, the strategy can reinvest profits into future trades which means order sizes may grow as your balance increases. That's the overview of the three comma signal bot, a powerful way to automate your alerts or pine script strategies while keeping full control of risk. For more details, check our help docs. They also cover webhook based controls, including enabling or disabling signal bots, stopping bots on specific exchange accounts, bulk closing positions and other group actions. Thanks for watching.